Right, so you all voted for it, so I'm here to deliver it. This is the Rosas Axe. I figured the Beast Champion armor would go best, considering its sort of design. And of course we got the Royal Knight helmet. I've also thrown in some Rancor pots and um, freezing pots, just to help us apply some pressure. Especially as we are fighting this absolute monstrosity. Beautiful, going with Frost. Right, so I've got to be careful here because if I get hit by that, he's got Royal Knight's Resolve on it. I'm probably going to die. I don't know if I'm going to die in one hit or not, but I'm definitely going to be in trouble. Let's use that to apply some pressure. Ooh, 332 damage. Wow, he felt that. Oh, that Vigor check. Okay, another pot. Another pot. <laughs> Just throwing all these pots constantly. Oh my god, I caught him with the second strike. Good fight. Yeah, you are a bit too slow. You probably maxed out his strength, to be honest. I probably would have died in one hit. Right, going up against No Gate. Give him a quick wave. So yeah, the Rosa Sacks, when you sort of hyper... So not hyper. When you're dual wielding it, or power stancing the weapons, it's actually quite good. So it reminds me of the Storm Hawk Axe. It's got a similar moveset. Oh my god, I hate that ability so much. Can okay, we get away from that? Because that's going to be a problem. Oh my god, please. Freezing pot. Oh. Yeah, I'm in trouble. Yeah, so when it comes to Giant's Hunt, it's probably best for me to roll into it. Because that way... Oh, that was a punish. God damn, that was a punish. Oh, 224. Oh. Dude, I'm sweating right now. Come on. Oh, and the 269. See, that overhead swing on the guard attack is so beautiful. It can catch them. Good fight. Right, going up against the Wisher King. I'm actually going to put a poll scene to do some strange cosplay builds. One of them will be Geralt of Rivia from the Witcher series. Um, but I want to get through the ones that I've got my backlog first. Oh, he's got Gravitas, hasn't he? Oh no, Piercing Fang apparently. Okay. Freezing Pot. Ooh, I love it. The hitboxes on Freezing Pot are so jank. It is disgusting. Oh, that punishment. Okay, let me try this. Rancor pot. Let him get aggressive. <gasps> no. What was it? Too slow? What happened? Yes. Beautiful. That's the reason why I got these pots. Throw it at them. They play aggressively. Get him with the skill. Good fight. Going up against Carl Johnson. I don't, know what that's a, well, I don't know what that's a reference to, to be honest. Um, is it a cosplay? Is Carl Johnson like a WWE wrestler? No idea. But, ooh, that hit. Freezing pot. Um, freezing pot again? No? Okay. But it's fine, because we've got the Rancor pot. Ooh, 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 right in the face. Oh my god, how did that not hit? How did I not get hit by that? Oh, it was ridiculous. Oh, 690. Dude, how much damage does each of these do individually, I wonder? Because I feel like only one hit him. And he got it done for 690. Dude. These must do a lot more damage than I think they do. Come on. Oh. Oh my god, slippery. Oh, a trade. Very nice. Okay, yeah, if I get hit by that on sheathed, I'm finished, so. Oh my god, I should have added in some throwing knives, god damn it. Oh yes, that one-handed hit. That one-handed R1 swing. I love it. Good fight. Right, going up against Riven Void. Let's see, got two freezing pots and 12 Rancor pots. 
So I've got to try and make the most of these before I restock. Oh, he tried to parry me. He thought I was going to go in with the... Wait, what? Oh, shit, he parried it. I didn't even realise he did that. I didn't even know you could do that. Oh, I need to be careful of that. Okay, let's go. What? Bro. There we are. That's more like it. That's more like it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Okay, Rancor Pots. Oh, 319. Good fight. Yeah, I was getting a bit nervous there. That's a Meteorite Blade as well, so that's actually quite a good weapon. Going up against Cecil Oscar. I can't pronounce that. I cannot pronounce that. Nice drip though. See, so he's got the eye patch on, the katana, some other bits and bobs. <laughs> Wait, what? Was he about to do an unsheath or something? And what on earth was that? Okay, here we go. Let's see. Can I get it? Oh, 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 oh. That was beautiful. <laughs> that was beautiful. He thought he had me. 1,500 damage. Straight up. Good fight. Going up against a knock 10. We've got dual hands of Melania. Or is that Nagakiba? I can't tell. Let me get the Rancor pot going. And then... Frost pot. Nice. So we got him frozen. And then... Oh, okay. I thought he was going to try and erase it for a second there. Oh, I knocked him out of the sky. <laughs> this is the first skeleton knocked him out of the sky. That is beautiful. Wow. I didn't know I can actually do that. I guess because it's delayed, it makes sense. Yeah, look at him. He doesn't want to trade with that again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 648, cool. Oh, oh. Skeleton. Oh, no. Okay. Come on. Come on, game. Oh, no. Why are my skeletons just going into the floor? Um, hmm. What? Dude. Oh my god, I don't even know how I hit him there. But I mean, in a good fight. <laughs> I think I hit him with the back of my weapon. Jeez. Right, going up against Ogre. I actually want to bring back my troll build. That was actually quite a fun build. Throw poop at people, get a damage buff. And then go in with the troll's golden greatsword. And literally just mess them up. 640, 664. Nice. Oh, oh, can I finish him? Oh, oh, that was beautiful. See, this weapon has so much potential. Good fight. Right, going up against Bic, which is a brand of, I think, pens and pencils, but okay. He's got a very rusty, or so I say, moldy looking wooden shield. So I'm interested in seeing what he's going to do with that. Probably parry. Um, right, let's get the pot. Nice. Straight to the face. Ah, oh, ooh, 590. Love it. Yeah, so your flaming strike won't touch me with this weapon. <laughs> oh my god, come on. Oh. Right. Oh, 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 you're going to be using that. Okay. Okay, yeah, okay. Uh-huh. Shit. I'm trying to figure out when's the best... Actually, hang on a second. He'll stop spamming it in a moment because his FP will run low. Either that or time will run out. Because that ability doesn't use a lot of FP. So you can just keep on spamming it like into eternity. Oh, 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 oh. Dude, what? Fam, what? Oh, dude, I love it. <laughs> I was surprised that didn't hit me in mid air. But I mean, I got him. Good fight. <laughs> right, going up against the last Marauder. 
And I see he's got the fingerprint stone shield. And he's fat rolling. So this is going to be just great. Wait, can this, is that, can this hit people from behind, I wonder? Hang on. Can this skill hit people from behind? Because if it can, that's actually really broken. If it can, like, hit a person that's hiding behind a shield, but, like, from behind. Hang on a second, let me, let me try it. When he stops rolling. Um, hmm. I mean, let's hang on a second, I got... Ooh, ooh, Gavel of Hamer. I've got Bleed Build Up. Oh, what, Stars of Ruin? Why? Oh, no, it can. Oh, no. No. <laughs> that is fantastic. It can hit people from behind in all angles. Shield users are being... <laughs> Good fight. <laughs>